Hello everyone, my name is Pujita and this is our team. Today we are having the debate on advantages and disadvantages of using a mobile phone. Our team name is Technology and our topic name is Advantages of Using a Mobile Phone. Hi everyone, this is Jahnavi and this is my team. My team name is Competing Facts. Our topic is Disadvantages of Mobiles. Here we go on. The advantages of mobile, we can communicate with others and we can... We can search the information in Google, Chrome, YouTube, etc. But many people use it in a wrong way. They use it to play the games and listening to the music, etc. and etc. Which is the wasting of time. It depends on the people mentality. These apps are made for gaining knowledge and knowing the information. But not for playing games and spending more time on mobile phones. Yes, of course. It depends but also leads to this addiction. Addiction means dependent on mobiles. Addiction to mobiles is termed nomophobia. There should be a certain time which should be used to spend on mobile phone. We can control most of the devices in our house using cell phone. For every small thing, if you use device, the, the human may be become lazy. These, these devices are being controlled by the mobiles for the people who are tired from work and studies but not for the people who are lazy and sat at home. Maybe it is a one of the advantages of the mobile but it leads to distraction. It means mentally disturbed. Mobile is a disturbing device that creates a distraction between your works. It is only for people who use mobile for long term and it is also useful to communicate with others. Although it is useful for communication with relatives, friends, etc. But if you do not use it properly, it can create distance from our from our relatives, friends, etc. That are that the close to us. For example, if it is observed many times that the family members sitting in a restaurant and stuck to their phones and not talking with each other. Yes, we agree this. It is a source of entertainment when we talk with other people but listening music watching movies or calling for a long time with headphones and headsets can cause the, da the can the damage the listening potential for listening music and watching movies we can he hear the voice without using headphones and earphones not only the ear problems excessive use of mobile phone can cause some mental disorders as anxiety anger depression serious and etc but some people use it for education purpose only. Nowadays, we are seeing some videos for students to learn the competitive exams. A part of them, many students and teenagers are mainly focused on playing games, watching movies and other entertainment on mobile phone. It leads to loss of their study. It helps the people who investigate for evidences. Alright, there are the more devices than the mobile for the investigation. The, mobile, the people struck in the mobile the even they walking on the road chair driving in a car the people are while mo using the mobile reach to car accident the they put their life and other it's a, at the risk there are rules that we should not use mobile while driving but no one is following the rules all, all everyone is uh, using mobile phones in everywhere we can buy any item we want in this world by the help of mobile. We can we can buy we can even buy items through post. But we don't even have to move from our places to buy the things. But it is helpful for the hackers to hack the accounts of others and takes the money. <coughs> The mobile has many safety rules, safety features like a, if we accept an email or or open account, the money will transfer. We can have information about like nature and different THS. Yes, but the harmful radiations coming from the phone are very harmful to human beings, nature and animals too. Yes, I agree that there are some disadvantages, but I won't agree that there are only disadvantages of using a mobile phone. Yes, I agree with your point. Now I, un now, I think you all understand how to use the mobile in a proper way. So, I request all of you to use the mobile in a proper way for an important work like education purpose, business marketing, etc. And etc. The whole thing about this debate is that using your phone for less time. And do not get addicted to it. Thank you.